code blocks is a good editor but it doesn't have lots of themes and syntax highlighting so if you go to settings and editor and you go to syntax highlighting you will see only one theme here see only the plain white so we'll, we'll try to add a couple more like about 17 theme from Godblocks website so let's close everything keep it closed while we are doing this so we need to close it and also we need this file you will find it in the description so the first thing is to go to Windows Explorer and then you go to C and then users and then your username and then click slash app data then roaming and then you go to the code blocks folder here you will find this default don't come it's a it's a configuration file so make a copy for just up for backup copy it and then paste it anywhere you want I will paste it in the desktop this one just for backup just in case we mess up something so we can have we can restore it so and then we op we open this file with any text editor I will use sublime text and then we open the file that we downloaded you will find everything in here just select all and then copy everything you can close it now and then here in the in the default file default.conf file we will search for this word so control f so we'll, we'll search for color color sets color underscore sets so you'll see it here you will find maybe nothing is only the default theme what we're gonna do we're gonna delete this one here and replace it with what we copied before so delete it and then edit and then paste so everything is pasted here save the file file save and then close now every now basically everything is done so we're just gonna check it we open code blocks and then go settings editor and then syntax highlighting and as you see here we have a lot many of many themes you can try them all and choose whatever you want so this is all what I have today if you like this video hit subscribe thank you